All right, ladies and gentlemen, today we're going to look at the first lesson for Microsoft Word. Uh, the first direction that you can see, it says to scroll to page two. So we want to make sure that we're working on the second page. It says to select the words for rent and change the font size to 48 point. So we're going to do that by holding our finger down on either one of those words and we're going to press select. Then we can use the two little circles here to expand our selection if we need to. And at the top, we're gonna click on the font and select size 48. All right, it says with the text still selected, change the font to Frank Franklin Gothic Demi or one that is similar. So we're gonna click on where our fonts are scroll down till we see the F's Franklin Gothic is what we're looking for or something similar and we'll click on that the next step says use the change case command to change for rent to uppercase so that is located underneath this A with the triple dots underneath the home tab we'll select that and we're going to click the change case button and we're going to change it to uppercase so this would be a good tool to use if you accidentally uh, typed something with cap locks on or if you decide you just wanted a change of style we're also going to change the word for rent to gold so in the middle of the home tab we can select the letter a and we're going to scroll down until we see the gold color. It then, the directions then say to remove the highlight from the phone number. So same thing that we did before. We're going to click and press select. Expand our selection so the whole piece is covered in the middle of the home tab we're going to press the highlight option and select no color and then it says select all of the text from for rent to the phone number and click center align so same thing down to the phone number we're going to click the A with the paintbrush next to it, or my mistake, the just the regular paintbrush, and then we're going to click center align here. And then we're going to scroll down to the very bottom of the page and select all the text below about Villa Pina and change it to or Villa Pina and change it to italics like that and that's it for the first lesson so you just want to make sure that you go ahead and save and make sure you call it your last name underscore word L1